Hey guys, today we're gonna to be doing a quick review of the Spirit Over the Toilet Cabinet. I got mine in the Espresso color, and I will be showing you how that compares to my Espresso cabinets over there. So first we're gonna talk about how this goes together. So this thing basically comes in two halves, the bottom and the top, and you guys kinda of start with putting together the bottom piece, and slowly as you guys build the two halves, you eventually just attach them together right here in the center. This took me about two hours to put together, but I wasn't extremely focused. I was kinda of multitasking for a bit and cooking some dinner, but it was pretty straightforward. It wasn't anything really complicated. All right, so now I wanna compare this color to my espresso cabinets. So I have a light here, so hopefully you guys are getting a good idea. You can still see some of the browns in there. And then these are what my cabinets look like. So it matched really well, actually. As you guys could see, there are a few ways that you could mount that wood piece just because of the water line. So there are multiple heights you could try out there. And we still have a little bit of room right there to set some items. And I really like the edging that they went with on this. It's not just flat, so it looks a little nicer. Once again, you have a storage spot right there that we're probably gonna put a basket in. And you guys get these polished silver handles and there are some pretty nice hinges on this. So you guys get two little shelves right there. The back is just like a little panel but uh, it looks like real wood. And then up here, you do get some areas where you can mount this straight to the wall so it won't fall. But I had some electrical behind there, so I had to get a little creative with how I attached it to the wall. So I actually ended up using some 3M tape on that side, and I just made sure to hold it on there for a long time. And it seems to be holding just fine, even with opening these doors. Really, it's just there just in case there's an earthquake. It's important to keep this mounted against the wall so it won't fall on someone. And just in case you guys are curious, that is what the top looks like. It is still the same color. And overall, it fits the space very nicely. There's plenty of space on either side of the tank right there. And you guys could fill this up with a lot of stuff. So it's very useful. And I think it makes this wall look much less empty. Alrighty guys, so that's my really quick review of this toilet cabinet by Spirich.